what's up everybody welcome back to third person this is the third person podcast that's mike you got me chris we're talking westworld season two episode seven yes man mike look i'm gonna say it i've been saying it to you off camera i'm gonna say it again Mm -hmm. this this episode was balls out man this was such a great every damn scene to me was amazing yeah you know they 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 turn that notch up to that knob up to 11 man and i don't know i don't know man there's so much in this episode there's so much in this episode i mean we'll try and be concise but yeah it's dude it's funny because we're following each and everyone's path each all the different characters right from getting from a to be and they're converging this last couple episodes these last two three episodes really it could have just been one huge one there's so everything is so intertwined yeah and it's just so good um because we're just the way they you know everyone's path and everyone's destination and it's just very smooth and um everybody finally meets up and that's but you know what's what's crazy is that yeah we get the big we always start out at the beginning. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. We always start out at the latest the point, at the most yeah, present point. in the point. beginning of it. Yeah. And then when it goes back, you're like, oh, and then it flips back and you're like, oh, crap. Damn. Yeah. So all this stuff is happening. I love it. It's mm-hmm. like, oh, my God, all this crazy stuff happened, but we're here now just talking about it after the fact. It's like, that's I just what, like it. Just... That's a big difference between the first season that a lot of people were turned off by is because there were so many different timelines at one point. Um it, w- it, w- it could be a bit confusing. They they tightened it a little this, bit. Yeah, this they, season they is, they made it a little. So yeah, it's not so. I drastic. know some people who are still confused by it. I'm I'm not. Listen, some things. But... I mean, some things. I'm like, hmm. You really gotta. There, there Wait, are. Some when moments... was this? Yeah, there's a little. Yeah, a little... You're, you're, did I hear that right? Or let me rewind that. Let me because you 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 can definitely miss stuff. And, yeah. you know, if you don't listen uh, and you're not focusing, I had I had to go back a couple times because yeah. I, I needed to hear. Um. I want to I want to I want to talk about the uh just inside the base man just mm-hmm. in that whole control air everything that happened in that control air dude those those vests yeah how freaking dope was that you, they used it as like sonar dude mm-hmm. and it's like, brruh, brruh, and it and all of a sudden they fired it like dude man. what a sick idea man like such a fun fun idea and then Teddy going complete beast mode just absolute beast mode McLaughlin done He's yeah. out. Everyone, the dude, the second in command, dude. When um, uh, the guy that was um, he was uh, taken by uh, what's her name oh, on the show? The, go- the 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 pretty one, the one that I the, yeah, I the, like. the one that yeah, the, the, host, the hostess, her. yeah. That yeah. okay. So here's the scene. I'm like, oh, this guy's totally gonna get played. He's oh getting God, played. Yeah. He's getting played. And then all of a sudden, she pulls the pin. And I'm like, oh damn, okay. Uh, but so she's that's taking you know, one for the team. I lo- yeah. dude that well okay so so they so that was her plan. Everybody thought when they found that they're going they're going towards the cradle. Okay, where's what's the cradle? The cradle is where all the backups are, right? Yeah. So Hale thinks that oh they're gonna go take the backups and and but they won't get to them because they're they're you know they can't they won't be able to get to them, you know like they won't be able to access them. Meanwhile, Dolores is like nope. I we, we don't I don't want that. She says the, these are the chains that bound us. That she you she said you kept bringing us back to in your sick little fantasy world. She's like, but we don't want that anymore. We're, that's not who we are anymore, and whatever. And you know, yeah. But then Hale fired back at her and says, okay, well, well, then how are you going to reconcile that with what you've done to him? You know, talking about Teddy. Yeah. Um, I love when um, Teddy shows up and pulls a gun on Stubbs. He's like Teddy, and he's like, eh, no. <laughs> um. You know, Abernathy wakes up, has that moment of lucidity, you know, and she ends up, she, I, dude, she was going to cut Hale's head open, like. Right. Just. Right. Oh, sorry. It, it, you know what? It's, I, I can't. It's so good. No, it was good. So it was good. good. You know, um, Dolores s- speaks when she's speaking with, with Charlotte. She's saying how um, um, you guys, the humans, wanted a chance for eternity by making themselves as hosts and all these kind of things. Um, some, what what James Delos initially was trying to do, um, but she says you made us like you, but you want to be like us, right? Yes. So it's it's uh, that that says a lot. You know, it tells you how the roles have reversed and how woke and, they really are. Yeah, yeah, and you how know? they're ready well, at to least, do, at they, least they, some they, of them. You know, yeah, and they and they mention how you know we're, you're free. They they use that word a lot now. Yeah. These and you know. 
going into that, you know, when, so again, Ford, like I said, you know, and, and, um, you know, we called it, man, Ford, Ford copied himself before, you know, he even says, he even, you know, he even says to Bernard this episode, he's like, you think Delos, he's like, you think James Delos would have just put all this money into some dumb thing? Like, he's like, no, he's like, I copied myself. He's like, oh, so that control unit you had me bring make was for you. He's like, yeah, of course that's mine. He's like, did you know, did you have Dolores kill you? And he's like, no, he's like, but I knew she would. Yeah, he's he had like, this. He had his back. I knew she would. Go. You know, they walk outside. They find out. You know, he, a couple things. He says he knows that he wouldn't live. He wouldn't be able to. He knows that it's not perfected. That if he were to go out into the real world, he'd degrade and he'd be done. He's yeah. like, but in here, I don't have to. Number one, two. We find out that the hosts were the control group, which was which is insane. I mean, yes, we knew it, but hearing it out loud, they were the control group. The humans were the variables. Just mm -hmm. the concept mm -hmm. of flipping everything up like that. Yeah. You know, and just hearing it again. It's fucking super smart. They're they're, they're yeah. there to decode the guests. Like it's just the yeah. whole thing. The whole first season, you think it's this one thing, and then you now you you know, obviously this is it's just it's so good. It's, it's yeah. such a great idea. And the fact that, you know, I don't know, just like Ford's like, I'm not leaving. Like, this is my world. And then, then he bounces out and, and piggybacks onto Bernard. He leaves the, he leaves the, 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 the system. And yeah. She's like, Oh, it's clear. We're good. And I'm like, wait, I'm thinking, I wrote down, I'm like, did Ford go into hiding? Like what? Then I realize, Oh yeah, I bet you he's in. And then all of a sudden he sees, you know, now, now he's in there. So what's his game, dude? Like, what the hell is for, dude? Ford, I know I keep cutting you up, but dude, Ford completely turned against humans, dude. That's insane to me. Yeah, well, that was his only way to to live forever. You know, that's his only. We've seen that, and that was, was such a great episode with James Delos and all that. We've seen that it couldn't work. Yeah, we, you know, you couldn't. They couldn't build a physical host with your to house the human consciousness. Yeah, right, yeah. Um, <sighs> How about the how about this the scene where um, he's you know, he's guiding Bernard? He tells yeah. Bernard to tell Elsie to go downstairs and yeah, get, a, get out of you know, here, get her out of get, here, you know, get out of here. And he's like, "Follow me." And then there's the the devil's guards. guards that he bumps into, and and Bernard is talking back and forth with with Ford, and like, "Who the hell are you talking to?" And all this kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah. And and then finally that that scene where. Um, the lights go out, and you and you know Bernard is firing on these guys. You see Ford with the weapon, also. Yeah, because it's so Ford. it's Ford making him. Yeah, it's, but yeah. just a great way they how they showed that to it's us. It's very simple, so simple. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, it's like when when we go back into so when like Charlotte was questioning Bernard, and he's flipping out, and she's just like you know mm -hmm. analysis, and then he stops. Yeah, you know, and yeah. it's just so crazy. Because and then oh and then how they get into the the flashback that and it just yeah. does those quick cuts. It's mm -hmm. just I just love that stuff because it's so simple to do. When I was younger, you know, starting out in like filmmaking and stuff, like I used to do the same thing. When I needed to do a transformation, I would do that. You know, like that. Those. Yeah. It's all you need, man. It's beautiful. It's all you need. It, so anyway, yeah, it works. it's good stuff with that. Yeah. So absolutely just fantastic this story i'm not fine i don't find it confusing i'm blown away by just what it is i'm blown away by the by the the the, the, the hosts knowing exactly what they are there mm -hmm. although there's they, they there's a little bit that they don't know meaning we're gonna go to this valley like they don't really know what's there they don't really know what they're chasing they're chasing something right yeah um but just the simple fact that the humans are trying to you know it, I mean, man i'm just it's so great i'm trying to see what else we got here um, well, well, let's get into Maeve oh, and, and the Men man, in Black. Man, you know? man, man. So, dude, really sick when he walks in, doesn't even see them there. Yeah. He's just there to hide, right? Mm -hmm. She's there, and she just like, she, and he, so obviously he thinks that it's Ford, and she's like, dude, no, you don't know what you're talking about. Dude, yeah. he gets fucking wrecked. He gets smoked. She wakes yeah. up, and here's the best part she woke up Lawrence, who was already woke, okay? She mm -hmm. couldn't control him, but she manipulated him perfectly. She got him thinking, yeah. and she got those those flashbacks of 
and you know uh, William he, he was remembering his daughter and his he, wife. She says, "Use all the memories." She said, "Use yeah. the memories." You look look at him, look at his mm-hmm. eyes. You know, mm-hmm. dude, he got mm-hmm. smoked, man. He did. It's hard to believe that he's still alive. I th- I was like, are they killing him right now? Yeah, I'm like that I, would be insane. I mean, listen, he was shot. He was shot in both both arm, both shoulders, shoulders, the leg, the thigh, the, the chest, the chest yeah, you dude. know, in the stomach or whatever, you know. So yeah, dude. That I mean, we we kind of talked for a, for a second about you know I, I'm assuming Grace is going to be the one. His daughter will probably be the one that that kind of saves him because, um, she has to, right? Uh, you know, he's not going to go out like that. So let's see how how he's rescued and and uh, in, you know in, in the next episode or or further. You know, you know it's and then so you know so Sizemore comes. You know, they shoot Maeve. And I was like, oh, no, what are they doing? You know, like, I just really enjoy Maeve. I, I don't want her to go. Yeah. And, you know, um, did, did we mention Dolores seeing her? I don't think we did on it. Uh, no, no, just at the end so, you're talking. Right, yeah. yeah so, Dolores, because, you know, my point is, like, I, I thought Maeve, I, I'm like, I thought she could, like, tell herself, like, no, you won't die from this. But then but then I think because the it's the body. Like, if the body goes down, right, so – you know, what are we going to do? You know what I mean? Like, I think, oh, we were talking about this off camera, right? I believe. Yeah. So like if someone has Alzheimer's, their mind is not Alzheimer's, uh, Parkinson's say something like that, that affects the motor, the motor skills of the body. Your mind is fine, but your, your body just isn't doing what it's supposed to. Yeah. And, and, and that's essentially what they are too. There's just a consciousness inside of this body. And if it's not going to work, it's not going to work regardless. Yeah. Of whether or not you think you can or can't like that's the whole point so anyway i was a little i was upset you know and then dolores says you know let me let me just put you out of your misery and she and then she thinks better of it and she says no okay you know what i'll let you do it i'll let you yeah, she uses that 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 same line that, that they've all been thing, using. yeah you know it's it's um you you know you're f- free to choose your own your own path right um, and she said but then she says your path ends here she thinks she's gonna May, die she thinks May's she's not die, dead yet Maeve's not dead listen, yet just like I said with the Grace thing, Grace yeah. will save the men in black. Sizemore is alive. Sizemore is going to save Maeve. It's, yeah, probably. It's uh, he's still there, right? Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna do something. He's gonna patch her up. Um, yep. So, I mean, look, the oh, man, they're they're on their way. They're gonna go to the valley. We're getting closer to what happened, and that's all that. Mm-hmm. That huge bot. Those. That's what they're going. I think where those bodies were. Yeah, yeah. That the valley, uh, the valley of the of the beyond. Right. We see Dolores going after that. We know what the motive is for the Delos, and all they want is the control unit. They know now. Um, Bernard tells them, you know, it's in sector whatever, part, you know, whatever it is. So they know exactly. Everybody's going to meet up at that at that uh, at the river. Yeah, she's she, and the, she's going to do some crazy. Hey, did yeah. we talk about the Menards, or was that off That's camera? Not- did we talk oh, about, about- the Bernards? No, we talked about because uh, I was a little confused by that. I was like, at first, what is what is the deal with the, the other Bernards? And- yeah, so so what happened was Arnold built his house inside. I was going to call it the Oasis <laughs> inside inside the the computer and or whatever, right? Or no, inside the park. Yeah, inside the park. So what happens is he set Dolores and Bernard together and kept you know getting Bernard to the point. This is what I thought was so trick, sick. Till he can trick Dolores into right. believing that it's Arnold because they said that Arnold, she knew Arnold the the They the used most. dude, that's how crazy dude, I'm telling you yeah. the writing on the show is so good. They yeah. used her memories because she knew him the best like you said Mm-mm. to 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 as the as the not the control group but as the you know the test bed for mm-hmm. whether or not that was the closest they could get to who Arnold was. Yep. Because Arnold passed before the technology before they were had the ability to give human consciences into a host, which is just insane, which puts mm-hmm. that back so far. And it right. puts it puts Dolores and Bernard and Arnold like it just puts it back so far, you know? Yeah. Like, it's like that is a history. So yeah, so until the day that Bernard could, could you know fool Dolores, you know, that's what happened and those were all the copies and stuff and i thought that was just sick how they found out so then of course they ter- they interrogate him and stuff and just man look yep great a- absolute great episode i'm um how many how many are we getting are we getting eight or ten we ten. ten i believe ten um yeah. 
So, uh, look, man, so good. I mean, I don't think there's anything else. I, I mean, I don't want to beat anything to death. You know, guys, yeah, you can no, I mean, you can tell us in the comments what you thought of this episode, if you thought it was great, if you thought it was dumb, what you liked, what you didn't like. Yeah, um, let us know what you think about the series uh, as a whole. Yeah. I, I mean, mean I, I was very positive this episode because I had so much fun. I had so much fun. Yeah. These, they're so fun to me. You know what I mean? I don't know why. I just find them. It's just an interesting show, and it's something that's, it's so different from every, anything else, you know, that's, and that's these really situations, there, man, right. Know? It's, and it's, it's the yeah. characters they put together. It's like, dude, man, they, they really went for broke with this. They're like the first season. They're like, let's build this whole thing up to the whatever. Yeah. Well, and HBO, season, you know, a HBO doesn't, um, doesn't skimp on, on, uh, picking the right shows man, just, and listen, picking the, so the, the right, the right actors to do the, to do the jobs. It's so good. And the it, writing is very just spot intelligent. On. It's great, it's very yeah. intelligent. It's um intelligent in that it in in how it delivers how it's delivering the information, but also how they're interweaving everything. Yeah, exactly. You know, it's, it's so just, just... just the whole storyline, and they'll, they're just just this the cradle, and there's just so much, and what Ford is doing now, and where he is as this um this matrix almost. It's um, I mean, it's great. It's great. It's great. It's great. Interesting so that's stuff. That. Yeah. So, all right. So, like I said, get to us. Let us know what you think about it. Exactly. Check us out at Third Person Pod, of course. Write your comments below in the YouTube channel. Don't forget to check us out on Instagram and on Facebook as well, Third Person Pod. And have a listen to us over on iTunes if you'd like. You can even watch us on iTunes. Though. You can watch us. Yes, that's true. Yes, so, you can check us, uh, check thank us out. You. We're out there. We're out there. Uh, thank you to everyone who does check us out, who listens and watches and comments and supports. We really Absolutely. appreciate it. Uh, we do this to start a conversation with you guys and, uh, you know, we're just two dudes, you know, sitting on camera talking about a, a show that we love. So, you know, thank you for joining us. We, we really appreciate it. So having said all that, uh, we'll see you on the next Westworld video. So thanks.